Hi, I'm Dan Ripacoli, and you're watching Mossy and Robbo's Fun and Games. So here we are, we've got Big Dan Ripacoli. It's been a dream of ours to get Big Dan on to Fun and Games TV. Mate, great for you. I'm sure it's been a dream for you as well, and welcome to the show. Ah, thank you. Thank you very much. I finally got to come on. Now, we, uh, we crossed paths, we came very close to crossing paths over in Glasgow, where, you, mate, you shot phenomenally well over there, bagging the gold and, and uh, bronze as well. But, uh, mate, what's been happening since Glasgow? Um, and there's a little thing called the Rio Olympics coming up. Oh, yeah, had a little rest straight after Glasgow. Got, had a bit of a high from there. It was great. And then um, had a little daughter, another little daughter. And um, now just in full training for the Rio Olympics. Has having a daughter made you shoot any better? Uh, not, not yet. I've got two of them now, so I'm going to have to lift my game when they get a bit older. There's a joke in there about shooting and having a daughter, but we'll leave that for, to, for now. Now, anyway, mate, moving on to Rio. First of all, have you ever been over there? I went to Rio once in 2008. It was a lovely work, place. Work trip, business trip or sporting trip? All for sporting, sporting okay. only. There's no pleasure here. What are the shooting conditions like? We're hearing about the water over there. It's, it's polluted. Um, there's problems with some of the venues getting ready. But the shooting, mate, how do you reckon the conditions will be? Shooting range will be great. It's based on the Sydney, sh- Sydney Shooting Centre, so it's a great range and it was good back in 90, uh, 2008, so it'll be just as good now and better. Hopefully uh, some of the favelas over there, I know they can get a little bit risky and there might be a few uh, people trying to vie for the Brazilian shooting team over there, but hopefully you can stay out of their tracks. Now, mate, big important question here. Um, obviously, you know Jumpy. This is little mini Jumpy and you saw him in action over there in Glasgow. He's obviously got his spot uh, for Rio booked in already. Um, there's, there's the boxing kangaroo. We've all seen him before, but this is Jumpy. He's, uh, he's there as a backup mascot or a reserve mascot. What do you think of Jumpy? Jump, Jumpy's looking sharp at the moment. He's put a, put a bit of time in the gym. He's looking good. He's I was going to say, he let himself go after Rio, he, uh, but he's, he has been training a bit lately. Yeah, check out his guns. He's doing some work <laughs> on them guns. Sun's out, guns out, they say. That's right. Now, over in Glasgow, we had the mascot, Clyde. Over in Rio, a little fella called Vinny. Now, I don't have the actual mascot, but I've got the next best thing. This is the Vinny hat, and uh, this has come from Rio. got sent it recently, and, mate, do you know what it is? No idea. I have absolutely no idea. They're telling me it's part cat, part monkey. It's a culmination of all the animals in Brazil. Um, And, yeah, it's called Vinicius or Vinny, and you're going to be seeing that all over the place. Mate, I'll I'll let you uh, put that on if you like. Um, You'd be probably one of the only Australians to have worn the Vinny hat. And, uh, mate, it's looking red hot. Feels nice. I think I'd rather the kangaroo, though, to be honest. (laughs) Very good. Now, he's not as sharp as you think. No, no. (laughs) What's been your favourite mascot over over the years with the Olympic Games? Do you remember any of them? No. <laughs> I don't know. I really don't remember, to be honest. <laughs> and uh, as we do here at Fun and Games TV, we want, we want you to go away today with a, uh, another gift. And, uh, mate, I'd like you to present you with your very own Naked Runners headband. This oh. will definitely make you shoot straighter, more accurate, and, uh, and you'll be on the money, I think, with this. Any chance of you getting this on, you think, over there in Rio? They're telling me there's 100 pieces of kit. This could be the 101st pit piece. I'll be happy to wear this in Rio. Yeah, and at any other training event before it. <laughs> but all right, mate, well, we'll let you go. Uh, good luck with the shooting. Well done on the uh, addition to the family recently, and we can't wait to cheer you on all the way to Rio. Uh, any final words to leave us here, mate? Uh, just thanks for your support over the last couple of years. It's been great to get to know you blokes, and uh, hopefully we can have a beer after Rio. All right, there we go. Big Dan reps. All right, back up to you guys. Stop. Unload. There's not stuff on.